Hello kids and welcome back to Life in the Woods. Unlike what I had planned, I didn't do any off-screen grinding. I didn't get around to it. So uh, we have enough food, I guess. Our backpacks are a bit of a mess. Oops, I meant to get that. I think we're gonna grab a little bit of extra red granite though, because you never know what we might end up doing and it's better to be a bit more prepared. Just throw it away, we don't need it. And that was the perfect amount for the messy backpack going to get dark soon um what we're gonna do today honestly i don't really know we're just gonna see what is going to catch our eye at first i mean i would like to do a rough outline of the buildings on the mountain just to you know finally get around to that because i have been looking forward to that for a while and i'd like to just kind of get a bit more progress done on that area but also there's still terraforming that we need to do and some other things. I technically really want to work on the list of little things that are missing in every cabin that we made like, I don't know, 20 episodes ago? It was a long time ago and so far I haven't worked on any of that and it's just like a bunch of decorations and other stuff that a lot of cabins still need but for some reason we are not really getting around to that. So, yeah, we also need to do that. There's a lot. There's a lot. Also, technically, I'd really like to connect this path here. And this means we have to go through the bushes, which is heartbreaking. I have to see if we can, you know, just extend them onto the other side a little bit. Also, uh, not terraforming, but cabin mountains. Gravel, and we'll just see what we can do. I don't know where exactly to start this. So, I mean, this is somewhat good. This isn't going to destroy that much. I am so sorry, poor little bush. You were a good one. Okay. I'm afraid we, yeah, this would then be a good connection to this one. And this is kind of going through the entire thing. Ah, I am so sorry. Oh, now you can see all the mushrooms lying around. Um, okay, so we go down for this area. I guess we keep on this level. Wonderful! So that is completed. Most of the bushes got to stay intact. Bless you, boyfriend. <laughs> I'd like to try to rebuild one here, but if we really build the staircase up here... I don't know how much space that is going to take up, so... Uh, I'll just, uh, you know some other day, maybe, hopefully. I thought that was Rhyolite, I thought that was a marble, and I was like, why did I leave this scummy work there? I mean, it's not scummy, it's not like it was cobblestone, but you know what I mean. So, we have potential space for cabins there, for one or two, and then up here we get into the interesting terrain. Uh... I need to be careful to not just fall down here. What's going on here? With the, we just have another cliff. We have another cliff. Oh boy, not what I ex expected to be dealing with, but okay. Um, we'll clean up the grass around here, just so we really have space and I don't have to be sad if I accidentally remove it. I think these worked without shears, but just to be sure. Okay, that grass all the way over there gets to stay. Um, ground covers. And I guess we'll just try to build something here. We're gonna start with a library. Um, that is not going to be too massive. And technically I'd like to build with bricks. Would have been smart to bring some bricks, right? Imagine planning. Um, 
Maybe we have the vanilla bricks. I mean, I guess we could chisel those actually, and then we could build the school out of some other bricks. Um, that would be some nice ones. Or is this not going to be it? Maybe the white ones? Let's see. Ooh, those do look nice. But I feel like... Maybe a bit too serious for what I have in mind here. Um, where are the normal stone? There is the normal stone bricks. Okay, we'll make a rough outline first. Um, maybe with dirt. Then up until wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's going to be we. That's too big, honestly. There's not so many readers in the world anymore. Like this, maybe, because then we can have a nice little double door. And no, we can have this but then we can also extend it a little bit up into like here so we ground cover and then up here you can have like I don't know that's that's too small I don't know but we'll work with something around here somehow maybe just like this actually Uh, I don't know if I'm fully vibing with this. If we were to chisel some planks, maybe. Is there anything? Maybe the chisel planks aren't going to be. Unless they go with like such a clean look for the outside, like with this one, you know the. Panels, I guess. What materials are we going to build this out of? Because I thought maybe really just like stone bricks or normal bricks, but I feel like those are like too too heavy. Yeah, well, let me. Just, if we were to just I mean, let me try something with spruce here, and then we can try to put some. Bubble stone, I guess, in between. So you could have like a back here, you could maybe have the little checkout area or something. Ah, uh, no, no thing there. And vanilla cobblestone. I mean, we could chisel it, of course, but also there's many other cobblestone variants that we could use to, you know, keep things looking a bit different, especially from, like, the walls and stairs that we have right over there. The lighthouse. Yeah, I think we'll we'll go grab a bit of cobblestone. And... Uh, oh, b -b 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 wrong backpack. We just throw all our trash into this one. Except for like those few pieces here, those can go in there. And we go home, and it's about to be a little bit loud, and I apologize. Uh, there we go. Okay, let's see, what would be a nice stone that we don't really have in the area already? That's too dark, the Mikmay tide. I mean, maybe uh, we could. I mean, let's let, let's get a few sample pieces. I feel like this might be too reddish. Mm, yeah, this reminds me too much of red granite. And this is it looks better. I mean, potentially, but I don't think it's gonna be it. Let's see, um, if we put this away, um, so yeah, Basalt and Riot were already working within the area, we have the dash side, or the bl black granite is too dark, definitely. 
Like, nice, we worked with four house, so that is always a recommendation. I want to see some... Well, actually, one stack of that. One stack of those each, stack of that side, and then we put those away, but get a whole stack of it. And we'll just see what... Okay, that looked like it was cobblestone for a second, and I thought we grabbed the clean variant. Do we need anything else? Probably. But I don't have it in mind. Why is it always getting dark as we run up the area here? Also, I just love how most of our food has just been wasted on the constant back and forth between our home and the project. So, you know, all these <laughs> ways up the mountain, they're, they're kind of hitting us, you know. <laughs> but it is okay. We have a good food storage. We have a massive farm that I really need to harvest, but I'm just not getting around to it. <sighs> Okay, and we I need to remember to like stay around here so we can actually sleep here because we don't have anything up there yet yeah for example like I said things that we need this is supposed to become a bookshelf in here I was thinking about maybe changing things a little bit but you know maybe a bookshelf here maybe we'll change the picture put the book and quill over there and then have like a bigger bookshelf or a plant potentially and like yeah this is just a cute little bedroom i hope you're not hearing any background noises i apologize if you do uh, okay uh, yeah right sometimes we just spawn inside the house when the game is like you are motivated to work now let's let's get stuff done I do like the path up here though. It's it's pretty nice. I've gotten used to it and I think we did a pretty good job. You know, not perfect, but for my level of terraforming, it is the best I could do and that is what matters. Oh, look at how clean everything looks down there now. Almost a little bit too clean. <laughs> okay, what's going to match the area here? Let's start with soapstone. I mean, it, it's classic. It looks similar to the vanilla cobblestone. And it is definitely kind of high up on my list. How would the gap row look? I like it. I, it matches well with the spruce, I think. Maybe even a little bit better for this rather than a soapstone or nice glides. The classic, you know, where we build our house with it. But compared to the gap row, I feel more likely to use that. How would the death? That looks also somewhat... Yeah, okay, that one's brighter. If we were to put the gap row next to it. Yeah, okay. I think mean, that's also really nice. Actually, me... Okay, this kind of sucks with the lighting right now, so let's do that. I like both. I really do. This one has like this slight purplish pinkish touch of you see what I'm seeing and this one is like more natural it's actually kind of tricky I mean I, I have a connection to this one. <laughs> oh yes I'm a normal person this yeah this is a little bit too serious and we just have the soapstone do we go with Depro? A gap row with the dash site where you combine two to one. I mean, I like how this looks more like cobblestone still. But... I think actually we go with dash site. Maybe I'll regret it. But I don't know, right now I just feel like this might match the whole thing a little bit more. Then it's really small, actually. Should we maybe try to go into the more eccentric aspect of this? I mean, we could try. Yeah, we can't have a lot of bookshelves around, but this is a rather small community. We could have two 
two levels. Very much a possibility. Let's see. Let's... Uh, where, where is everything else that we need? Uh, we need spruce wood. And all this stuff that we don't need right now, I'm just gonna put in here. So I don't confuse myself. So I can see that happening very, very quickly. Otherwise, the wood. Oak? Pine wood? Wood spruce. I feel like spruce might be too much. So I'm not really leaning towards that right now. Let's see though. Spruce. It's gonna make everything look so dark. It would be a good floor, but... A classic. Looks also really nice since the cobblestone looks so much like the vanilla cobblestone, at least right now from my eyes. And pine. I do like pine wood. Just ignore the fact that this is out of made all the trees in the area here. But I think maybe really pine wood? Yeah, Ogus. We'll go with pine wood. We will choose pine wood once again. Uh, let me just grab that. A little bit of stuff to work with here. Um, here I definitely want like a nice little window. Not too big, since obviously we need space for books. <laughs> um, this can be closed up. And then we can have a nice big window back there. Okay, I'd say we go with... Three and a half blocks ceiling? Or maybe three blocks. Because then we don't have any weird gaps over the bookshelves. We do technically need to dust and all that. <laughs> um, I think three blocks maybe just... I mean we can always remove the floor and add uh, carpenter's blocks if we want a little bit more space. There, leaves falling on our head. Okay, and there we go. And then for the next level, I'm gonna try something. This, I'm really going back to the roots of my building style, so I don't know if this is going to be much of a look. So if it looks awful, don't yell at me right away, okay? <laughs> Uh, go up here. L hey, this... <laughs> I didn't keep this one in mind. Well, that kind of sucks. Couldn't we... Wasn't there an option to... Or does it not exist in this version? Am I... Switching it up with something else? I think I am. Uh, <laughs> ah, yes. Alternatively, we just do that. Looks weird though. What's the alternative? Um. Not a fan of this. I'm really not. But again, when are we really gonna see that? Like, you're not even really gonna see it much from the stairs, I think. And if not, there's, there's already a tree here. We're gonna put another tree there and then you can't see it. Problem solved, I guess. <laughs> to the best of my abilities. Um, we're running out of spruce wood. That's not good. Because I wanted to make the floor out of spruce. Can we use these to... Can we do anything with these? <laughs> no? Okay, well... Then these just exist now. <laughs> um... But what we can do real quick... Is realize we're out of glass too? Why do we have nothing with us? I, d I don't like this thing here. Not, not a vibe. Not a vibe at all.
Okay, why why is the game bullying me like that? That just looks a little bit weird if we do half the spruce like that in the corner. And that also makes that one look a bit weird, but actually in this case it almost and then it's unsymmetrical though. Really, what am I doing? We'll just have to book a put, put a bookshelf there and learn how to talk again, I guess. Um, okay. I can't do anything right now. Can't build. Can't talk. Can't teleport. What are we even trying to do here? Okay, that can all go in there. Um, uh, this little thing goes in with those. Okay, we have a little bit of time left. Um, grab like 18, just so we can make a few more. This was one too early. We do need more spruce wood. Anything else? I'm just, we could, I guess, already get a door. I am very much considering a carpenter's door. Do we have enough carpenter's blocks? We have 16. Is that little weird thing we checked? Um, there we go. Carpenter's door, spruce, planes. And it's good. <laughs> we really have a rhythm for when we need to go home and collect new stuff. Like, you can almost set a timer for that. Okay. It's getting a little bit too dark for comfort right now. Uh, okay, let's kind of hurry, because I don't want any creepers around here. I really like the plant pot there. Like, this adds such a nice little aesthetic to the cabin, makes it feel a little bit more alive. I like, I don't know. kind of fell in love with that. Back to all the way back there. There. God, why, why why is this really in the furthest corner? Uh, oh you, you can kinda of see things, but you don't see the ugly area, so <laughs> that's good. As long as the little oopsie isn't very visible, um I'm fine with everything. You really don't see it. Ah, uh, from up here, wow. And we'll put a cabin here, and so... No one's gonna notice in a little bit of time. Okay. The windows look wonderful. Okay. Also, I'm fully aware that we do not have bookshelves with us, but we'll do that after I finally do some off-screen grinding again to get more burlap. Uh, <laughs> what am I doing today? Um, crate. Maybe the smooth ones. Kind of empty everything out already. Wow, we didn't accidentally remove blocks that we weren't supposed to remove. I, I do like the look of those. <laughs> okay. Question is, do we try for like a short little staircase or... Do we just go with a ladder? I mean, ladders would be a little bit uncomfortable, considering it's like a public space. Um, so I'm gonna try something. Okay, and we'll only go with like a singular. We're not gonna make a double staircase here, just like, you know... Something small that gets the job done. Then you could have bookshelves underneath this, actually. Oops. Um, did 
we have spruce bookshelves? <sighs> we have to go with those. And those don't cover the full block. When I had a mind was from the 1.20 mod pack, I was playing with the boyfriend. Unless we were to like put a slab there. That could maybe still kind of fix things. Also, we don't need the glass panes right now. We really don't. So then you can normally put the bookshelf there. And... <clears throat> um, do that. Looks a bit weird. But... You know, kind of does the job. Okay, let's let's try to cop and eh, not that one. Where is there we go? It looks so similar to the vanilla one when you have it right next to the other one. Um yeah, okay, this <laughs> oh wait, 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 no 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 never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. I take everything back. I don't know if this is really a vibe to put the... Okay, we already did that with that player. Why are you st um, here pine planks for that? No idea. Couldn't tell you. Is it a look to have, you know, more cobblestone upstairs? I don't know. We're just gonna have to wait and see. Um, spruce, 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 spruce. There we go. A little bit of extra spruce. Yeah, two blocks, and then I'd say we'd start with... No, come on. We go for three. Four? Two, and then we start the roof on, you know, the outer levels anyway, so it's going to be okay. Did we have a full-on thing going? No, we didn't. Um, why is that there? <laughs> that shouldn't be there. I was like wondering why it's looked so wrong this whole time. Okay. First off, just plank, and we can add some windows later. Um, okay. <laughs> Little adventure jump run here. I see, I see. This is not not perfect. It really isn't. It's very far from perfect. Right. I'm getting close to the ending of the episode, so... Let me... Do this real quick. We go with the smooth ones again. Uh... Game. Okay, I thought it was crashing for a second. It was a big lag. We haven't had any lags lately, so that was that was something. Oops. Might look a bit weird with the stairs, but I think it might be okay. -ish. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Do you slam your head on this? You don't. Good. Then bookshelves underneath that, bookshelves all around here. Maybe we could have like the little checkout area here. And yeah, this is this is a decent start to the library, I'd say. Um, not that, but the carpenter's hammer. For once we go with the nice glass double doors and yeah i'd say that was it for this episode thank you for watching thank you for sticking through the little struggle of trying to make things look good somehow which is always quite the adventure when i'm on it oh actually that's more spruce 
And yeah, maybe I'll be able to do a little bit of off-screen stuff before the next episode. I really would like that. And yeah, I can't wait to maybe have this somewhat done before episode 500. We have to see. Stay tuned for that. But yeah, thank you for being here. Stay hydrated. Take your meds. Take your vitamins. Stay happy. Take good care of yourself and others. And goodbye!